Destiny. And it is hump day, so you know what that means. It's time for Bubble Bath Beer Review. Sorry about the last two weeks. I was on medical hiatus, but I'm back and hopefully ready to review a hopefully really super, super tasty beer for you. I just wanted to get a little bit of shameless promotion out of the way. Uh, I always talk about how my beer reviews are brought to you by the Jesse Gooby Shower Drinking Team, the best damn shower drinking team on Facebook. We are celebrating our one year anniversary as a team and we're having a meetup. So for information on that, go ahead and look us up on Facebook, the Jesse Gooby Shower Drinking Team. I'll put it in the description as well. But it'll be a good time and it's this coming weekend. So RSVP and come and join us and get your drink on. All right, so this week, I have decided to review Mad River Brewing Company's Imperial Cream Stout. It's the 26th anniversary. It's a stout aged with oak. I love stouts, y'all. <laughs> I'm trying really hard to like break out of the stout thing, but I can't. Let's see. We don't have any clever um, labeling here. It is 9% alcohol by volume, so this one's going to be this one's going to pack a punch. So stouts, I typically appreciate more if they have the essence of chocolate and coffee, but not the sweetness of chocolate. So we will see how this guy goes. Oh, you know what? Okay. In case you're wondering, like, what a problem this shower drinking is for me, my, sorry, <laughs> my bottle opener is up in one of my shower racks. Okay, so I'm going to open this here. All right. Sorry. So unprofessional. I'm just not prepared tonight. It's I blame it on being sick. It smells like vanilla. All right, here we go. Yeah, I definitely taste vanilla. It is hearty. It is a little sweet. It's a little sweeter than I want it to be, but it is a cream stout, so I mean, I can't, I mean, you can't really complain. If you're drinking a cream stout, you better expect it's going to be a little sweet. Mm. It smells more like chocolate than it tastes, and you can definitely taste the coffee. The coffee doesn't come till the very end, though, so you get the, like, the creaminess. It's like a... It's almost like a vanilla latte in beer form. It's, yep, yep, tasty. Um, I'm gonna give this one a 4.25 out of five. I will purchase this again. I will drink this whole bottle. This whole bottle will get me drunk here, let's just check. <laughs> because it is a strong baby. Or let me pour it for you. I'm still gonna get my beer glasses, leave me alone. You know, I only really get shit on Twitter for it, not really anywhere else. Oh, God. She's beautiful. What a beautiful baby. Oh. Yeah, it smells a lot sweeter than it is, but it is, uh, it, it is a little sweet. But it's really good, and I definitely will buy it again, and I suggest you try it. If you love stouts, you'll like this. If you don't super love really strong beers and want something to, like, ease your way into it, this is a good guy. This is, this is a tasty beer. Mm -hmm. So that is all I have for you this week. If you can think of anything you really would like me to try that you'll want me to review, let me know in the comments below or hit me up on Facebook. Otherwise, I'll see you next week. Cheers!